Columbia Business School wants to learn a lot about applicants through its three essay questions, which focus on your career goals, why CBS is the right program for you, and more personal and character-focused topics. Overall, the admissions committee should get a profound sense of who you are, both personally and professionally, from its questions, and offers a generous 1,050 words to convey impactful stories. Great opportunity. Hi, I'm Jeremy Scheinwald, founder of MBA Mission. And in this video, I'll be reviewing how to write successful CBS application essays. For more on how to get into CBS, check out this video with my colleague and CBS alum, Rachel Beck. Let's dive in. The first essay question asks applicants this. Through your resume and recommendations, we have a clear sense of your professional path to date. What are your career goals over the next three to five years? And what is your long-term dream job? While CBS largely instructs you in the prompt to not rehash your entire career progression, often giving some background on what you've done in the past can then nicely lead you towards your goals. Maybe you worked on a project that highlights a new professional area for you, or it could be that you collaborated with a team that, that really interested you. And looking ahead, those experiences have helped you crystallize what you want to do next. In such cases, giving some background will enhance your essay. Being clear on your career goals is crucial for CBS. In fact, the adcom will want to feel confident that your goals are achievable, reasonable, and feasible when they read your application. Therefore, you want to make sure you somehow connect your past with your future in laying out those goals. For instance, if you're working in luxury goods marketing and want to move into asset management focused on high net worth clients, it's important to show transferable skills. So think about how you can prove that you have the analytical skills and also tie your focus on wealthy customers in your current role to your future role advising similar clients and their investment strategies. You just can't leave the admissions committee guessing. You need to show them the path. CBS also asks about your dream job in the longer term. While CBS wants you to think big about what your future might hold, still keep the school anchored in reality. Think about where you see your career progressing in the next five to 10 years and what could be something you really aspire to achieve down the road. Make sure, however, to have these dreams link nicely to what you plan to do post MBA. Well, in this question, CBS doesn't directly ask applicants to give any reason for why CBS is the right program for them. If you have the extra room towards the end of the essay, maybe the last 100 words or so, you can share specifics about how a CBS MBA would be the key in achieving your next steps. Your focus could be on how the core curriculum or electives might enhance your knowledge base and how the leadership offerings at CBS will provide you a toolkit that can be applied across your career. By the time the adcom is finished reading this first 500 word essay, you should have a good sense of where you see yourself professionally in the future. For essay two, Columbia wants to know that applicants have really thought about why this program works for them. This question asks, why do you feel Columbia Business School is a good fit for you academically, culturally, and professionally? At just 300 words, this essay gives you a small space, but you still need plenty of depth. To effectively answer this question, you must do your research, and even more importantly, think beyond just why this program is the right fit professionally for you. Remember, the MBA experience extends beyond just what you do in the classroom and where the recruiting process leads you. You want your time at CBS to be personally fulfilling too. So consider what components the program will help you achieve that comprehensive experience. An easy place to begin your research is to look at the professional opportunities the program offers. Sure, classes fit in this bucket, but where will you center your studies? Is there a particular program, like the Value Investing Program, that stands out? Don't just list things out, but give some context as to why these opportunities are important for you. Then dive more deeply into what CBS offers you professionally. Think of the clubs and associations, which will connect you with like-minded peers, as well as industry professionals and alumni in your field. You can also highlight the great CBS advantage of being in New York City, the opportunity to do an in-semester internship, for example. This will give you a head start on a career change or serve as a great resume booster. Also, dig into what about the CBS community stands out to you. You'll be spending two years immersed in this program, so what is important for you to do during this time? For instance, CBS is very globally focused with a big international student body. It has the Chazen Institute, which sponsors its global immersion program, as well as study tours. 
If expanding your global mindset is a goal for your MBA, then CBS has a lot to offer. Additionally, CBS places high value on student community work and offers a lot of different ways to connect with the local community. Look through the service-oriented clubs as well as more formalized opportunities like the nonprofit board leadership program. Lastly, think about what's important to you during your MBA experience and how CBS fulfills such desires. For one, CBS places a high priority on collaborative learning, as evidenced by its cluster system. Additionally, consider what kind of extracurricular activities CBS might offer that sync with how you like to spend your free time. Building bonds outside of the classroom with your peers is an important part of the MBA experience. And not only does CBS have many special interest-focused groups, relating to sports, healthy living, demographic backgrounds, affinity groups, and more, but it also has the benefit of being in New York City with a thriving arts and cultural scene. As you approach this essay, you want to take a step back and ask yourself why CBS is the right school for you all around. By doing so, you'll be able to convey to the school really why it's the right fit. Essay three. Tell us about your favorite book, movie, or song and why it resonates with you in 250 words. All too often, applicants read this question and they immediately begin rattling off business books they want to highlight. Don't do that. Instead, let's take a step back and think about what this question is really asking. Truthfully, the book, movie, or song doesn't matter. No one is judging you based on your choices. It's the story being told in the backdrop of this essay that's the key to successfully answering this question. So let's start there. Before writing a word, think about important stories for your life. The first two essay questions are focused on your career goals and why CBS. So the outcome doesn't need to know anything else about your work life. Instead, this essay is an opportunity to tell them something more personal about yourself. Think about times in your life when you've overcome or changes that you've made, successes that you've had. As you consider these life events, think about why they're meaningful to you and hence, why you think the ad comp should be told about them. They might represent a time when you achieved something you didn't think previously possible, or they might showcase your ability to rebound from a difficult time. You could write about helping someone else or how an event changed your life. There's so many options. As you consider these stories, think about the books, movies, or songs that tie into these experiences. It might be that you spent a summer doing something completely beyond your comfort zone and walked away from that experience better for it. And when you hear a specific popular song from that time, it reminds you of what you achieved that summer. Or maybe watching a movie or reading a specific book helped motivate you towards a goal that seemed out of reach previously. Given the short 250 word count, you can't dedicate too many words to discussing the book, movie, or song, but can use its meaning, title, or lyrics to illustrate the significance and why it resonates with you. So, there you have it, an overview of Columbia's three essay questions. If you'd like our expert help on your CBS application or any other MBA applications, schedule a free 30-minute consultation by clicking the link below. I'd also recommend you download our Insider's Guide to Columbia Business School to learn even more about the program. It's free on our website and linked in the description below. Meanwhile, thanks so much for watching. If you enjoyed this video and want to get more MBA admissions and application tips, don't forget to like it and subscribe to our YouTube channel. Best of luck with your application to Columbia Business School and all other MBA programs.